I won! Oh, I, I gotta, I gotta save this replay. Give me one second. Great. But wait a second, I don't have a capture card. How am I supposed to show this epic moment that I captured in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate with my friends on the internet? Hey everyone, Super Andrew 64 here. Did you just play an epic match with Piranha Plants and you want to share it with the world, but you don't have a capture card? Fear not, because there's an easy, easy, easy solution I'm going to show you. All you need is something that reads micro SD cards that you can plug into your computer, and obviously a micro SD card from your Nintendo Switch. So I'm going to walk you through each of the features and show you how to do this, and hopefully that you can share your epic matches with the world, and let's check it out. So what we're going to do first is very simple. All you have to do is change your replay video into a uh, video file. So where you go is to vault, then replays, replay data. Then we select the battle we want to convert to video. So it's this one, Daisy versus Piranha Plant. Then you go down here, convert to video. Then you name the file, what you want it to be. So we'll just do this one as test. Then on this screen, it's going to ask you to convert to video, which is the plus sign if you're using the Joy-Con or Pro Controller. So then all you do is you let the whole thing play. And that's simple like that. Okay, now that the video has finished converting into a video, we can get started. Now what you want to do here is completely turn your Nintendo Switch off. Don't put it in sleep mode. Don't take the micro SD card out right away. Turn it completely off until this screen shows up. So you hold the power button and then you select turn off. So what you're going to need next is something that plugs a micro SD card into a computer. I got this one on Amazon. It was about $10. It can do USB type C, USB A and micro USB. So all you do is you plug the micro SD card into the side of it, plug it into the computer and it should show up as USB drive. So you just click that and then you go to Nintendo folder. Then you do album, then extra. And then this folder there, 2019, which is the year. And then this is going to be the month. So the month is February, so that's two. And the day is 10. And our file is right there. So it's all, the whole match is all the way there. So all the way to the end. So there we have it. So that was my quick tutorial on how to move your Super Smash Brothers Ultimate video files over to your computer if you don't have a capture card. Now I personally do have a capture card, but I find this method a heck of a lot easier than plugging in my capture card, plugging in my switch. All I do is just unplug my micro SD card from my switch, plug it into my computer and I'm good to go. I will leave a link in the description below to let you know where you can find that micro SD card reader. And uh, this is Super Andrew 64 signing off. Have yourselves a one up day and let me know if you guys will be doing this method. See you in the next one. Thank you